Hey, Hannah, how are you doing tonight? The Patriots, they're 2-1 and one against the Pittsburgh Steelers on opening day. But it's not just about bragging rights anymore. Sports gambling ups the ante when it comes to, say, watching the Patriots. But it's not legal in every New England state yet. Loosening the reins on sports gambling, the Supreme Court's ruling in May 2018 opens the door for sports betting across the country. According to the American Gaming Association, $10 billion has been legally wagered on sports already. The AGA says 38 million Americans plan to take their chances on an NFL game this season. According to a morning consult survey, Massachusetts leads the way with the most adults, 18%, planning on betting. Maine and Rhode Island are close behind, both at 15%. 13 states have live legal game sports betting, including Rhode Island. It's now legal in New Hampshire, but not yet operational. You don't want to necessarily be the first one. Maine and Massachusetts are among the six states with legislation currently on the books. We're able to sit back, watch and see what other states are doing wrong, and then we, we have the ability to correct that or make that not make that same mistake here in Maine. Sports wagering in Maine has been tabled until January after passing through both houses. So no legal sports gambling in Maine this year. Milton Champion, the executive director of Maine's Gambling Control Unit, says if it gets the green light, he will be developing the rules, possibly in time for the NFL's 101st season. Say uh, Tom Brady's coming out and it's fourth and long, is he going to make the, the first down? That's the bet, and you got to make that quick decision right then and there. And then there's other crazy things like, you know, what, what color socks he'll wear for the game and all that sort. So it's a little bit more than just the, the fantasy contest. Champion says Maine could make between $3.7 to $6.4 million in estimated state revenue per year. I'm excited for Maine. You know, it's, it's in any business. You don't keep up with the competition, the folks will go down the street. And Jessica Gagne is going to have to check on what kind of socks Tom Brady is uh, wearing today because she's in the stadium right now. But that same morning consult survey says the New England Patriots are favored to win the Super Bowl again this year. And it's not just from Pats fans, it's from 23% of participants. Now it's important to note, if you know someone that has a problem gambling, uh, call 211 if you're in Maine for all your gambling help. Uh, that is the hotline. It's posted on our website and our mobile app. For now, I'm Clay Gordon in Foxborough for New Center Maine.